Thank you all for being here tonight. And I would like to thank UTC for hosting us and UCW for welcoming everybody onto campus and move to amend for hosting the sign-in table out front and also for In These Times and Mike Hilk for being with us here tonight. Um, my name is Patricia Bathemore and I am a volunteer with Chattanooga for Workers and I have seen firsthand um, the difference that organized labor makes in your life. Um, it's one thing to hear uh, statistics like 20% uh, union workers have 20% higher wages than non-union workers, or that union workers are 31% more likely to have employer-provided health care, or that union workers are 60% more likely um, to have employer-provided pension plans, or that they are 22% more likely to be provided with sick leave. Um, I have seen how that translates into real life living conditions. Um, I come from a family with a mother that didn't have the benefit of organized labor behind her. And I saw her, she was college educated, she's worked really hard all of her life. Um, and she went to work when she was sick because she didn't have sick days. Um, I've seen her stress about her retirement because she didn't have employer provided uh, pension plan or any matching funds. Um, and I saw her overlook health conditions that needed treatment because she didn't have good health care. Um, and I've seen her um, fired and pushed out of positions because she tried to improve the working conditions where she was at, um, which would have benefited her and her coworkers and the company that she worked for. Um, on the other hand, um, my father has been a member of the International Brotherhood of Electrical Workers for over 20 years. And I've seen the difference that that has made in his life, having a decent wage and being able to provide for himself and his family, um, having the peace of mind of job security and retirement and a pension plan, being able to take off work without the stress of losing wages whenever he's sick, um, having good health care and being able to have his health issues treated, um, and mine as well most of my life because I was a benefit of that uh, good health care. Um, and I've also seen that uh, the companies that he worked with were stronger for that because they had a strong, dependable workforce that was healthy and was happy and uh, more invested in the places that they worked with. So that's why I've chosen to volunteer my time with Chattanooga for Workers, which Chattanooga for Workers is a partnership of Chattanooga Organized for Action, um, the Chattanooga Area Labor Council, uh, local activists and labor supporters, which we formed in response to attacks on our local workers and their rights by out-of-state corporate finance front groups and our, um, frankly, out-of-control and out-of-touch politicians. And, um, let's see. We know that our workers work best when they work together. And we know that our community supports our local workers and the right to organize and work together for a fair wage and decent working conditions. And that's why we've come together. Um, we know that we want companies here that value their workers and are invested in their workers and value their workers' input in the management of their company. Um, so that's kind of my story behind why I've chosen to dedicate my time here. And as you guys know, um, 